I do indeed happen to be a silly pseudonym. Mm, do I want to do another Vortex run? Sure, why not? Are we going Architect Vortex or are we trying something else? Hmm. Am I giving my shield? Perhaps that's the better question. That's not the right specialization. That's not the right specialization at all. That's also not the right specialization. What is this game doing for us? I'll take the rate of fire increase. Let's get some mines. Load up these mines. I think the game's going to show us every specialization except the one I won't. Hmm. Sure. We do need to get down to charge shot. Now you're just mocking me. I do want this and I do want that. Uh, sure. Tempting. But not this time. Hmm, not this time. Rate of fire is acceptable. I tell you, the game knows. More burn damage is pretty good. Alright, we'll go for it. Do we need deflagration? Let's try something different. Okay. You teased game, but you delivered at the end. I appreciate this. And I thank you for it. Ah, uh, so many things I want here. I want that, but I really should get charged mines. I really, really should. Also take this absorption. Take the revelation. Take the skirmish. I want that, but I want this even more, I think. And that gives us some um, significant increases to mine effect. I don't know if I want Rancor. I do want armor, and I do want Blitz. I do want Deadly Wake. Let's get some armor. Force armor also sounds pretty good to me. I do like Rupture, and I like the stabilization. Mm. Rebuke is good, but do I want mastery? Increases projectile size, spread, blast radius, rate of fire. Definitely do not want... A learn version here. For obvious enough reasons. I like my vortex to pull the enemy in, not push them away. I'm glad I chose the warp shield. Nice to have some different coloration for our mines over here. These mines are detonate very quickly. I could try snipe. See if the well, the extra velocity doesn't really do much for us. It makes the little I'll shoot so the vortex do a little more. Well, I'll give them a little more speed, but is that worthwhile? Retribution is maybe decent. We can try it. Stabilization would also be okay. A little extra speed is quite welcome.
Hmm, makes our minds much more powerful, but it also means they take longer to build. Let's give it a shot. That I should not have done. But I forgive you, friend Comet. I forgive you. Hmm, Warpath is... Tolerable, but do I just want the regression here? The winnow is not bad either, but regression gives us another level. And we do get bonuses based on our... No, that's engineer, right? Yeah, engineer gets bonuses based on our level. Well, we get another level. Do I want this, or do I want to look for Essence Sap? I still need... Another couple of upgrades to really get down to Essence Sap is the thing. Hmm. Let's take the channeling. Now, of course, the problem is that I need my mines to actually be able to charge up, or they don't do much good. So when the enemy runs into me like that, and I drop a mine, that's when retribution is not as useful, I guess. Damn it. You're being a little aggressive today. I'm gonna have to ask you to calm down, relax a bit. More burn damage. Slightly improved rate of fire. Let's get some more burn damage. Very pretty, very pretty indeed. Well, you didn't hit me this time, Comet, so... I'm fine with this. Hmm, we could look for deflagration. Could take the blitz. Do we really need deflagration? I don't think we do. It'd be nice, don't get me wrong, but most of the enemies are going to die fairly quickly without deflagration. Anyway. Meanwhile, getting down to Essence Sap is... helpful. And a little extra damage is fine, even if it's not... It's going to be too amazing. I would have preferred Terminate, but... You can't have everything you want out of life. Or maybe you can. What do I know? What do I know indeed? You need to watch out. I'm getting a little bit low on my mind. That is the downside of the Apex machinery, after all. Need to be a little more careful, he says, as he wastes a mine.
Essence set for healing or rebuke for armor? Let's try the essence set for healing. Wave 200. Always nice when the Celestial just dies. Even nicer when the Seraph just dies. I assume that was a Scion. I saw the Scion summoning. That normally means Scion. I can't help if I didn't survive long enough to actually do much. Blink would be nice. Once again, we could get deflagration, but I think I just won't blink. Just something to help me get out of trouble every now and again. I did that one, Comet. That was my fault. I shall not blame you for it. That was on me. But that is a lot of Celestials. It survived for a little bit. Yep. I was worried about that. At least Essence Sap allows us to recover quickly, as long as we deal some damage to enemies. Hmm. I'll take the rebuke for the armor stat duration. Just need to remember not to accidentally hit the fire button. That's fine, everything's fine. Even more juggernauts, because what else would you want but more juggernauts? Trying to make sure I had time for my minds to rebuild. Don't want to run out at the wrong moment. That would be a problem. I liked it better when you would die quickly, Seraph. Hmm. Rancor is more hole in plating, but slows me down. Could just get the thrust from stabilization. And then if I get it, Rancor's an option again. Maybe I'll be fast enough to feel like I can take it and not suddenly be unable to maneuver. Again, Seraph.
The downside of this pink color is it's harder to see the pink enemies. Purpley pink. Well, I guess it is more pink compared to those enemies. Uh, those are more purple. Deep purple. No, you need to just go away. The mines are not as bad if they arrive piecemeal. The rest will be a little bit more challenging if they arrive all together, but so far that's not happening. need any of these I don't think but I guess we could look for that deflagration after all would be better to more centrally locate that but not always easy to position ourselves to do that. Terrible. Good, 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 good. Another chance at Rancor, but I might just want that core shielding, better armor, self damage resistance. Not really applicable to us, but the extra shield slash health is of some use. I am just collecting all of those bulwark revenge attacks. And that is not something you want to collect. We finally got there. Not the most efficient way of doing it, but it, it, it counts. Ah, uh, tracers. Such fun to have enemies that are invulnerable. Especially as the rate of fire for them increases. Definitely glad for that armor duration and absorption now. Alright, Comet. I'm beginning to think you don't like me. I think I'm getting this message. And eh, hello, Scion. Seems a little unfair, but I guess using Vortex all the time is a little unfair myself. Alright, where are you? Reroll. I like rerolls, but I like experience so I can get a level up even more. Good grief. Leave me be. Oh, you survived. Let's rectify that. I see you, Comet. I see you. Uh, 
does this really do much more for us? Probably not. Another chance at Rancor. Agility is not terrible. Self-Destruct is a tiny touch more damage. Only a tiny bit. We can try the Rancor. It does slow us down a bit. But it's a little bit more hull and shield and not shield but plating and Oh, weapon damage, I guess. And this is when the absurdity begins. Oh, so much absurdity. I don't want to stand there, if you don't mind. I want to stand over here. Nope, not there either. Good enough, I guess. That's, yeah. That's something. Oh, you. I don't like you. Thankfully, we have enough damage to get rid of you quickly. Yeah, this vortex is probably something that counters them fairly well just because they don't really move much. And the vortex doesn't move much, but that's fine. Vortex will just eat you alive, sitting right where it is. Now, well, there's deflagration. Could pick up defiances for some plating, but I don't know if it matters. Trying not to... Boy, I liked it better when you could not rotate so quickly, Zion. I liked it much better when you could not rotate anywhere near as quickly as you do. going to be that. I'm glad for that absorption and plating we have. Because otherwise we would be in a great deal of trouble with that wave. Don't 
really... Yeah, we don't have a good answer to... Lots of shielded enemies. But... As long as we don't get pushed around too much and have time to get our stuff charged up, maybe we'll survive. Or maybe not, who knows. Okay. Try to rebuild our mine stockpile a little bit here. We could not get this far without mine specialists to help us out. We would be in so much trouble otherwise. Remember when it was easy to get level ups? I remember. Those long lost days of old. Uh, hmm. Uh, hmm. Scorching Wake is something. Could get 0.5 plating. Warpath is slightly better rate of fire. And suffering. Trying to stay away from that. I'm trying to stay away from you, but it doesn't matter because you have a shield. And you have a weapon with infinite range. So, yeah, about that. I don't know what's going on or where I am, but that's fine. We'll just keep dropping mines every now and again. And assume it will work out. Just go away. Yet more fun with tracers and celestials and tracers. At this point, there is a tension between my desire to keep a stockpile of mines 
my fear that something is going to arrive on screen so quickly that if I don't have a vortex going, I just explode. And that is the paradox in which we live. Yep, I was trying to get it, but it did not time that one well at all. Uh, do I want purification here, or do I want to keep my weapon damage up? Right now, we're just trying to kill the enemy quickly. I don't know if the burn damage helps us out that much. And we can't really recover the shields, and we can't recover our health, except through essence sap, so yeah. Agility would be nice. Self-destruct is fine. What else would I be looking for? More rate of fire. More rate of fire. before the storm. What were you going to be shielding? Uh, tracers. Not the best choice. I already have a shield. Uh, don't stay there. Yep, this is... Uh, I was about to say this is where we die, but apparently not quite yet. Yeah, that's where we die. Ah, close to 3 million. I wasn't even looking at the score. So close. <laughs> yeah, that was just too much going on. Too many places. But it was fun. It's always it's always good to have a Vortex Mine, Mine Specialist build that really gets going. You can do so much damage. Only problem is you can't really see the enemy. I appreciate the effort comment. I appreciate that. Oh, that is a new high score. I ah, haven't posted one of those in a bit. Uh, pretty ink. Yeah, it barely made it, but barely is still barely. I'll take it. But right now, I shall thank you all for stopping by.